Wankaya Ja. Hello, my name is Kimimila. That means butterfly in the Lakota language. Wankaya Ja means sacred one. And that's what you are. Wankaya Ja means that you are very, very special. I have some friends for you to meet. Hi, everybody. Hello there. Hello, everyone. Hi. Hi, everyone. I am having a giveaway. A giveaway is when we honor people with gifts. Hey, everybody. Hi, Camila. Hi, Hi, Brady. I have something for you. <gasps> oh, it's a little bag of flour. Mm -hmm. <gasps> I think I'm going to go home later and make a batch of fry bread. Mmm, that sounds good. Fry bread is delicious. Mm -hmm. I'll just put it in here for you. Thank you. And here's a bag of flour for you, Cubby. Oh, fabulous. I'll bake a cake for everyone. Thank you, Kimamila. You're welcome. Flour has so many uses. We can make flour out of wheat and corn, too. Yes, flour is important to us. I brought you a bag also, Flying Thunder. Oh, so kind, so kind. And here's a small bag of flour for you, too, Turtle. Ah, I'm going to make some fancy cookies mm -hmm. and put lots and lots of chocolate chips in them. Mm -hmm. I like chocolate chips because they're so yummy to count. Mm -hmm. Can we count now, please? Not yet, Terry, but mm. we can count later. I promise. Okay. Hi, Bibi. Here's your flower. <gasps> oh, oh, no. The bag fell apart. There's flour everywhere. Oh, I am so sorry, Bibi. We'll clean it up. <laughs> Never cry over spilled flour. <laughs> but now I don't have any flour left. <laughs> now I can't make any fry bread or cake or cookies. Oh, you can have my flour. Really? Mm -hmm. You're going to give me your flour? Yeah. Oh, Brady, you're my best friend. <laughs> Camomila, Brady mm -hmm. is my bestest friend. Baby, that's wonderful. So nice of you to share, Brady. Thank you, Kimamila, for this giveaway. The bags of flour are very special. We will use the flour and think of you. You're so welcome. Thank you, Kimamila. Thank you, Kimamila. Thank you, Kimamila. You're, welcome. You're so good to us. Yep. Mm. I know how to say family in the Lakota language. We say Tiyoshape. Can you say Teoshape? Uh, Camomila. Yes? I know what letter flower starts with. It starts with F. And so does fish. I know a good word that starts with F. Feast. Whoa. Yeah. Mm. Oh, and friend. Don't forget our friend Frida the fish. She has two Fs in her name. There's also the Faircloth Nation. Faircloth starts with F. I know a game that I like to play with my friends. Frisbee. Yay. Frisbee starts with the letter F. I, I like Frisbee. I really like Frisbee. <laughs> family is a word that starts with F. Treating your family with respect is a must. Uh, hmm. uh, my family? They take care of me. My mom brings me nuts, and my dad takes me shopping, and um, my brother and I, we like to play in the forest. <laughs> yes, we all like to have a nice time with our families. What words do you know that start with the letter F? I feel like singing. <laughs> Why don't you sing us a song from the letter F, Brady? <gasps> Good yeah. idea! Good idea! F, 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 F. F is a good letter to be. There's feast, fish, and 
feathers too. My farmer friend has some flour for you. <laughs> Spend some time with your family. F is a good letter to be. <laughs> <laughs> nice. nice. <laughs> A feast is one way of spending some time with our families and celebrating. I always enjoy going to a feast. Oh, 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 is, is it time for the feast today? Yes, it is. Are you excited? I can't wait. Oh, yeah, feasts are good. Oh, I'm so yeah. hungry. I think we have a visitor. Oh, I hope it's Frida the fish. Yeah. Blah, blah, bye, everybody. Hi. Oh, well, hello, Frida. Hi, Frida. I came over for your feast, blah, blah, but I can only stay for a few minutes. I have to get back to the water. Well, let's start the feast right away. Yeah. We are having this feast to honor our friends and families. I've made food for everyone. Oh, boy. All right. Sometimes we have a feast for a name-giving ceremony. My cousin Jessica has a new baby, and my uncle had a feast so everyone could see the new baby. It was really nice. Mm. Look here, everyone. I've brought some fried bread. Ooh. My grandma made it. It's very mm. good. Have some. Can I have some with jam on top? I love jam. <laughs> sure. Me too, me too. So sweet. Blub, blub. Oh, I'm so glad I came over. This is so good. I'm glad you came over, too. I would just like to say that having friends like you is really important to me. I'm glad we're having this feast to honor our friendship. Me, too, Flying Thunder. I really appreciate your friendships. You are all just like family to me. Oh, Kimi Mila, that's so nice. <laughs> blub blub, I really like spending time with you too. Thanks so much for inviting me to your feast. I'm so glad you could make it. Blub blub, it was delicious. I better get going though. I have to get home to my little fries. That's what you call baby fish, you know. See you later. <laughs> Bye. Bye, Bye, Frida. Bye, Bye, Frida. Bye, Bye Frida. Bye, Frida. Come in. Drop by again sometime. Don't be shy. <laughs> Thank you for giving us this feast, Kim and Mila. The fry bread is delicious, and I had a really nice time. I'm glad. Me too. Yep. Here she goes. Back in the water again. <laughs> blip, blip. <laughs> blip, blip. <laughs> blip, blip. Now it's story time. Yay! The pillows are fluffed and we're ready to listen. Oh boy, oh boy, I can't wait for the story. Let's read a story about Terry Turtle, can we, can we? <laughs> okay. <laughs> this story is about Terry Turtle and Baby Buffalo. The two friends were going camping on the weekend. They packed up dishes, blankets, and lots of food. Bibi would run ahead and do high kicks and twirls. The day was near the end when they came across a clearing in the forest that was a great spot to camp. Bibi said, I'm going to sleep right here on this patch of grass. Fantastic, yelled Bibi. I'm going to sleep under the stars near this trunk of this big old tree. The two pals decided to make a little fire and cook some fresh ferns. Oh good, I like ferns cooked just right. So off Bibi went to find some firewood as Terry created a circle of rocks to contain the fire. They put some small branches in the circle first, then some bigger branches and lit a match. Poof, the flames looked furious. All of a sudden the wind started to blow. Terry was always cautious when he built a fire. He took a little pail and went down to the stream. It took him some time at his turtle's pace. Bibi sat beside the fire, enjoying the warmth. Terry went into his shell on the soft patch of grass while Bibi curled up under the tree. Good night, Terry. Good night, Bibi. The sky was full of twinkling stars and Terry wanted to take one last look before falling asleep. So he poked his head out of his shell. Terry shouted, Bibi, some flames are heading for the forest. 
Bibi jumped up and leaped for the water pail and put the flames out. Terry Turtle was happy that Bibi moved quickly to put out the fire. The end. Oh, that was a close one. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Good thing they had a pail of water nearby. You can count on Terry and Bibi to be careful with the campfire. Count? Did somebody say count? Yes, Terry. It's counting time. Finally! <laughs> What's today's special number, Terry? Fourteen. Fourteen is a special number today. Good. There are fourteen pigs in that family's teepee. You're right. I'm going to count them. Ready? Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen teepee pigs. <laughs> yeah. You're getting better at counting. You think so? Yes. Good. The pigs hold a teepee together and also stand for keeping your family together. First Nations people in the plains have teepees. It feels so good to be in our teepee. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Now, if you don't mind, I need to stretch my old wings. Oh. Stand back now. I need some space. Oh. Oh. That feels good. What's good for the body is good for the soul. I've had a wonderful time visiting with you in the teepee. I hope you can come see us again soon. Be good to yourself, Wankaija, sacred one. <laughs>